Welcome back to some more free run videos on mechanics and shortcuts and today we're going to be explaining how to do the new G-Slide without any weapons. As you know the YY G-Slide is still in this game where if you trade guns off and then hit the G-Slide normally you get it. But in free run that's not the case, you have no weapons to trade out, you never have two weapons at all. So and now the G-Slide is frame perfect, it takes frame perfect execution. What's going to be most important about this video is how to do it and not so much on the visual aspect of this video. But what you're going to do is you're going to jump like you normally do but instead of queuing up the slide button while in midair you're going to press the slide button and the jump button on the last frame before you hit the ground. So the last frame you're in air you're going to press the crouch button and the jump button at the same time. But this is no easy feat. I actually ended up having to tell somebody how to do it and they actually ended up pulling it off for me. This is what you're watching right now. It's from a guy named Eli. He's a PC player that I talked to. He's also a good free runner. You can check out his channel if you want to. And also the first thing to discover this move, his name is Cost. He's the best PS4 free runner in the game currently. He has very good content on free runs. And that's pretty much how you do the G slide. I'm sorry I can't help more. Um, you're, you're just gonna have to find ways to practice with it. Maybe go in scenarios where you're right on the edge and then try hitting it and then you'll get yourself conditioned to hit the G-slide right when you touch the ground because if you don't you fall into the void. So just practice. If the G-slide's too late you will just hit the ground and bounce up and if you're too early you'll just thrust and fly up. So without even hitting the ground. Um, as for controls, I recommend, I think it's the bumper jumper for control players where your jump button and crouch button are, are right next to you. So you can kind of th um, fat thumb it as one person says. You press the A but your other finger is still kind of over the other button. So right when you hit the ground you press both. So just kind of have be hovering over both buttons at the same time and then press it. So hopefully another 5 people know how to do this move at least at 50% consistency. <laughs> Only 5 people right now know how to do the perfect G-slide. And all people have just been saying different timings. But hopefully this breaks it down a little more on what buttons you're pressing. Because I know a lot of people probably just press buttons whenever they want to. And now it comes down to pressing them all at the same time. Track, if you're watching this, the skill gap has been raised by a thousand percent now. So if you want to see skillful people, I was just leaving this G-slide in. Why would I G-slide? It's up to you. But this G-slide, if you have the focus to pull it off while you're in a match with somebody else, you deserve to do it. It doesn't create different timings. It just raises a skill gap. And it shouldn't be a problem for these quote-unquote pro players to do it. As, as said, they are pro, so they should be able to know how to do it. But really all I care about is this evolving supply drops. If the game is too fun, they have to make the game not fun. So you're just saying they're opening supply drops. So yeah, it's whatever. Well, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys later. Peace.